Hi, this is Rachel with Good Behavior Beginnings, and this is another video in our series on incorporating ABA into homeschool. Today's topic is behavioral momentum. So behavioral momentum is the concept of doing a series of high probability behaviors in order to increase the likelihood that the learner engages in a low probability behavior that follows those. So we use high P and low P when we are structuring our homeschool routine. We start the morning with flashcards, then cursive editing and hidden pictures. These are all easy tasks for my child and we move through them quickly. After these, we start with more of the core curriculum that requires more attending and might be a little bit less preferred. If we were to start with the really difficult tasks or the less preferred tasks, we'd probably get more protest behavior and the child would be less engaged. Instead, by starting with some easy things, we sort of warm up, we get into the routine, we wake our brains up. That's the way I've explained it to the kid. We're just going to wake our brains up with some easy stuff and get to talking and get to thinking since we do start at 8 o'clock in the morning. So by doing those easier activities and then following it with one that's maybe a little bit more difficult or doing some preferred activities and then followed by one that's maybe a little bit less preferred, you can build up that momentum, that behavioral momentum to then have more success with that lower probability, less preferred task. So that's one way that we incorporate behavioral momentum into our homeschool. And that's another way to use ABA in homeschool. Thanks for watching.